Hello everyone. Tech, data and software are at the heart of today's automobile. I am right next to someone rather familiar with this subject. So Luc, why did you come to Renault? Didn't we scare you with our 125 years of legacy? Uh, listen, uh, the car today is like the telephone 20 years ago. A lot is going to happen. In my career, I had the chance to uh, work on these technologies used today by more than 1 billion people. This is useful technology, and that's why I came to Renault. Today, it is true that uh, there are more and more technologies embedded in our vehicles, so advanced uh, driving assistance systems, digitalization, big data, apps, cybersecurity, artificial intelligence, digital twin, cloud, you name it. No? and even a software-defined vehicle. Can you tell us about this uh, new technology? It is a revolution uh, that we are launching with uh, our software development teams uh, within Renault, in co-development and in open market with uh, Google and Qualcomm, for instance. These architectures will allow us to permanently update a vehicle remotely, to make them safer, to reduce their energy consumption, to fight against planned obsolescence, and to make traffic more fluid at the end. Making software in the car is about putting meaning in each line of code. And above all, we code to push the envelope. So today we want to put Renault at the forefront of the tech revolution. So we expect a lot from our developers, our data analysts, our scrum masters, and we are looking for the best. With them, we are launching a software and electric vehicle champion it's going to be called Ampere, and you are going to hear a lot about it. So the technological revolution is taking place today at our sites in Nice, Sofia Antipolis, Toulouse, and of course Paris. So now we are waiting for you. <laughs>